Most of the things I know very clearly, but some of these things I don't know that clearly. Because of one thing, The relationship between you and me is of course very intimate, that you should be in my body. But if you people are not meditating, it's a very mundane thing I must tell you, if you are not meditating, then I have no relationship with you. You are no, not my relation. I, you have no right on me. You have no question to be asked, why this is happening, why that is happening. So if you do not meditate, I always say meditate, meditate. I have nothing to do with you and no more there for me. It has no connection with you. Then you are like all other people. You may be Sahaja Yogis, you might have got your Sahaja Yoga, degree from your leaders maybe, I don't know, and maybe that you are regarded as something very great. But if you do not do your meditation every day, evening, morning or evening, you will be really not anymore in the realm of Sri Mataji. Because the connection is only through dhyana, through meditation. I've known people who do not do meditation. Then they suffer, their children suffer, then something happens, then they start coming and telling me. But I see clearly that the person is not meditating. I have no relationship with him. He has no right to ask me anything. In the beginning, of course, the meditation takes some time. But once you will know what is meditation is, how you enjoy my company, how you are one with me, how we can have a rapport with each other. There's no need to have anything else in between like writing letters or maybe some sort of a special connection, nothing. Only thing that is needed is the meditation. In meditation you grow. In that spiritually you become higher. And when that happens, you start in a way, I would say, that when you reach a state of <coughs> that, I should say, maturity in Sahaja Yoga, then you don't want to give up your meditation because that time you are absolutely one with Me. That doesn't mean for three hours, four hours you should do meditation. But it is how much intensely you are with Me is important. Now it is not how much time you are with Me. Then I am responsible for it, for your children, for everyone. I am responsible for your ascent, for your protection, to save you from all your negativity. So it's not like a father who will directly punish you. It's not that. But it's just, all right, you are not My relation, I'm out. That's the only thing that can happen. If you are not meditating, all right, I cannot force you, I have nothing to do with you. You may have other relationship outside, outward, but this inner relationship by which you get your benevolence, you cannot have without meditation. I've been telling all of you, please meditate, please meditate every day. But I think people are also not understanding the importance of what I'm saying. Because they tell Me, Mother, we don't meditate. Why? Now we are realized, so, so why should we meditate? Now this instrument is fully made, but if it is not all the time connected for the means, what's the use of having it? In that meditation you will feel the love, the Divine love, the beauty of that Divine love, a complete panorama changes. 
A meditative person has a very different attitude, a very different temperament, a very different life, and he lives always in complete satisfaction with himself. So today, as being the first day, as you say, of the Advent, say, we can say that it is the first day when the Advent took place, as we are worshipping today. Of course, it was not today, but still we can say that if that is so. If it has happened, uh, it has been helpful to you, it has been a great blessing to you, then must know how to preserve it, must know how to enhance it, must know how to enjoy it. You should not just get satisfied with one, uh, what can say, a, a one dance drama or one this thing, one that. But you should have a full oneness with the Divine, full oneness, and that is possible only if you really meditate, which is quite an easy thing to do, to meditate is... Some people say, Mother, we cannot get over time, we cannot uh, think... we are all the time thinking something, or that time we want to see the uh, watch. In the beginning you may have a little problem. I'm not saying you may not have, you may have. But that's only in the beginning. But gradually you will be all right. Gradually you will master it. Gradually you will know it so well that you would not like to have anything else of a cheaper type, you wouldn't care for such a thing. You see, so to get to your uh, beauty, to get to your glory, to get to your own great personality which is now exposed to you, only thing you have to do really, religiously is to meditate. That's not that Tonight I came very late, so I did not meditate. Tomorrow, you see, I have to go for work, so I cannot meditate. Nobody wants to know the excuses. It's between you and yourself. It is your gain, nobody else's. It's for your gain, everything is happening. Now, one has to know that we have achieved a certain height of evolution. And from this height, you might go up to here, up to here, up to here. I'm not saying it's not possible to do that. But first and foremost thing that whatever you may be, may consider you to be a very high class surgery, you have to be humble about meditation. This meditative quality, even when I'm talking to you, it's just I'm <laughs> getting into it, because it's so joy-giving. You just jump into the ocean of joy. First it will be difficult, but after some time you will know that this connection that you have with Sri Mataji is the only connection that you are looking out for. And also there is Another point people get lost with, which I have seen very common uh, with uh, some people who get lost. Uh, they meditate individually, very much, which is very correct. Individually they will meditate. And they will sit down, meditate, we do puja, we do... But collectively they will not meditate. So this is another point one has to remember that you have to be collectively meditative. Because I am a collective being of all... And when you meditate collectively, you are really very close to me. So even if you have a program or something, you must do some meditation with it. Always have meditation as the priority for any program. You sing the songs, it's over, everything is done, then you meditate. If I'm insisting on something, you must know that this must be the truth I'm telling, absolutely the basis of it, though it looks rather mundane, but it's very important.